we actually get a ton of training out of it. It's not just uh, what you see over the stadium, that five to 10 seconds. There is a bunch of hours previous to the flyover and after where we're actually doing our training. A lot goes into a flyover. There is a lot of mission planning, so we're figuring out what route that we're gonna fly over the stadium, taking into account the winds, weather. We have our maintainers who are getting the jets ready for us. And then lastly, our, our pilots are kind of putting in the, the final work into our plan. We have a couple great pilots on the ground at each of our flyovers, and we call them our grounds crew. So as ground crew, we are that link in the communication between the personnel at the game on the ground and then the air crew actually flying in the air. Doing a flyover relates exactly with what we see with our tactics in the B-2. We like to say that we'll be anywhere in the world on time, and that's exactly what we get to practice and execute for a flyover.